Hey guys, Mark here. Welcome. This video is going to show you how to make a paracord flower. To practice, we are going to be using about 3 feet of cord as well as a bead. For the cord, I highly recommend that you use a rounder, fuller cord other than flatter laying softer cord. Fuller cord gives you a bit of a nicer look than the flatter laying one. When it comes to your bead, it should fit a single strand of cord. It can be made out of wood, plastic, metal, or you can make a bead out of a knot as well. For example, you can use the Celtic button knot for this purpose. We start tying at one of the ends. Move about a foot into your cord, fold it into a bite. Grab the short end, which is now about a foot long. Use it to wrap around your bite. This forms a loop and places your short end in between the bite and the loop. Using the long working end, we are going to be doing a bit of daisy chaining. Form a bite, pass it into the existing bite, then tighten up. So we did this once, repeat two more times. A bite, pass it into the existing bite, tighten up. A bite, place it into the existing bite, tighten up. So we did this a total of three times. We now have our loop, the short end, three corners of our flower and a bite here at the top. Place your bite over these two strands. So the short end and the top of our loop. So over two. Then run your short end under these two strands. Like this. Grab this strand here. Roll it over the top here. Tighten up a bit here. At this point, we have a total of five corners of our flower. Tighten up these two corners here. So again, one, two, three, four, five corners. 
to form the sixth corner, grab your working long end, place it alongside the standing end. Under one. So, a total of six corners in our flower. Grab your bead, attach it onto your working hand. Run your working hand opposite to your standing hand, so to the opposite side. Under two sections here. Position your bead to the center of the flower. You are pretty much done. This completes our tutorial on the paracord flower with a bead at the center. I sincerely thank you for joining me today and I hope that you will join me in my future videos as well.